And that's what so happened. Can I ask you a question? What, no what, what, do you, what do you believe in? We believe in the Bible as it is written. Not what you see so called Christianity. That is not real Christianity. I'm not a Christian. Good. I follow Jesus. Exactly. Because guess what? Well, check this out. A Christian, Christian was made by the Watch this. Read uh, 1 John. But you're, Watch this. Hold on. Let me read this real quick, okay. sister. This is 1 John's the second chapter. Who got it? Watch out, yo, what's that doing? I'm just, I'm just asking, y'all loves them just, just I'm not getting into the debate. I, I, yeah. I got yeah. it. Yeah. I'm just trying to understand what he's saying. 1 John, chapter 2, verse 4. Three. Verse 3. Come on. And hereby, we do know that we know him. We know who? Christ. Read on. If we keep his commandments. If we keep his commandments, That's correct. Right. Read on. He that saith, I know him. That man that says he know Christ. And keepeth not. His commandment exactly. Read on. Is a liar. Read on. And the truth is not in him. And the truth meaning what? The law. You understand? The law is the truth, right? Ooh, what? The truth is Jesus Christ. Let's read yeah. it. Give me um, Psalms chapter one nineteen verse one twenty two. We under, I mean one forty two. When you understand, you're absolutely right. Remember, Christ is what? The Word. The Word made flesh. Right. So guess what? He's the law. Psalms chapter 142. He is the embodiment of the law. Psalms 119 verse 142. Come on. Thy righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. Most high righteousness is forever. Read on. And thy law is the truth. What's the truth, brother? The law. Right. Let's go back to um, 1 John chapter 2. He that saith I know him and keepeth not his commandments. That's why he said, that's why he said the commandments. You say you know Christ, but you ain't keeping his commandments. Is a liar. You're a liar. Read on. And the truth. And the truth. The laws. Christ ain't in you. Oh, Read so on. Only it's one not truth. in him. Watch this. Yes, absolutely. Read on. The word truth but whoso keepeth his word. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What you mean? What you mean? I'm saying you're saying that the word truth can only apply to the law, but the word truth can apply to this book is in my hand. It's the truth. Is this book in my hand? Right, but that's not this the, the truth. Then this book. No, I'm saying. Here we go. I'm, on, I'm walking. That's the truth. So is that the law? Because the watch truth this, is that this, I'm, I got this, white clothes watch on? This, watch this. Give me, give me um, Isaiah chapter 28. This is how you understand the Bible. Bro. There's different words that you got. Isaiah 28, start at verse 9. I can't pick out one word in the Bible. Isaiah right, 28, ahead. verse 9. Come on. Now let me show you something. Get though, this on tape, y'all. Put it on YouTube one time. Right. Though we said the truth is the law because we said the Bible said it, what does that mean? How did that, did that change anything? Christ being the word? The word? Yeah. yeah that changed a lot. How did that change a lot? Um, for us, right? When he came down to flesh? No, 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 no. What we're dealing in First John. Okay. We said the truth is the law, which is Christ, because Christ is the word made flesh. Okay. How did that change the meaning of First John 2? Right here, okay. Uh, it's going to be so, um, where we go? Uh, what's the word cliche? You're under grace. Hold on, hold on. You're going, you're going left. I, I'm asking you a direct question. Okay. How does that, it, when I said the, the truth meant the law right there, yeah. which is Jesus Christ, what you're saying it is Christ, how do we now have a, a, a strike between us? We have a strike because the truth is not the law. The law is a truth, but Wait, it's not no, no, no. the truth. The Bible just said, thy law is the truth. And right. you're saying but in what? In that context, when David, brother, David, brother, brother, David also wrote brother, that, brother. smash babies' heads. Do we do smash babies' heads today? Brother, he says, smash all their it's heads. Happen. He's not say that. Brother, it's going to happen, is what the scripture says. Let's go. Read what I just got you to get. Isaiah, I mean, yeah, Isaiah, chapter 28, verse 9. This is how you understand the Bible. This is why it's going to make sense when we go back. Read. Who shall he teach knowledge? Read on. And who shall he make to understand doctrine? Who's he going to teach knowledge? And who's going to get the understanding of this Bible? The doctrine those is who, the Bible. Those read on. Who, them that are weaned from the milk. Weaned from the milk. Read. And drawn from the breast. Come on. For precept must be upon precept. What's the precept? I teach you. Law. A precept is a law. Give me the Bible dictionary. No, no. Uh, hold up, hold up. We're going we go to make sure we everything that we say is it. as it is written. Because when you... Who has it? Who has the Bible dictionary? You didn't bring yours? We're going to make sure everything read that, that we say is again. as it is written. It, read it again. Read it now that we know... Isaiah something. chapter 28 verse 9. Come on. Who should, it, who should he teach knowledge? And who should he make understand doctrine? Come on. Them that are weaned from the milk. Them that are weaned from the milk. And drawn from the breast. Read on. For precept must be upon precept. Check this out, brother. What'd you say precept meant? It means teach. 
teach. Let's read it out the Bible uh, Bible dictionary. It's the Bible dictionary that is. Zondervan's Bible Compact Dictionary. Oh, teacher. teacher. Zondervan's Bible Compact Is that, is it like Zondervan? No? I never heard of that. I'm sorry, I know you didn't want to be like this. I just want to know what you believe in. I don't no, no, we're going to go through it, sister. But we're going to make sure it's as it is written. They believe that white people will not make it in heaven, right? Let's be real. Hold on one second. All right. What's wrong? I'm sorry. They're going to be there. Google precept. They're going to be there. They didn't put it in. They'll be in there? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, they're going to be um the, um, the, 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 the concubines, right? Who should teach knowledge? The white people, right? White women? Y'all don't believe Who it? Who said that? Who said that? No, I'm, now, I'm, I'm Hold on. So wait, wait, wait. Remember, you gotta, if, to get it from a man, you got to ask a man what it is like your sister did. You got to ask him, what it is that we believe? No, we're not talking about uh, dealing with other nations. We're so not we're talking about we're going to have the nations as, as wives. Yeah, yeah. Man, I, I must excuse myself. Right, right, right. Who should he teach knowledge? Yes. And who yes. should he make? Understand doctrine. Read, watch this. Watch this. It'll make sense. Them that are weaned from the milk. Come on. And drawn from the breast. Come on. For precept must be upon precept. So precept must precept be upon means, precept. 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 Means, precept means, means, watch this. From the Latin root to teach. It's also, it's also a commandment, instruction, or order intended as authoritative rule of action. Exactly. Read. So, before you. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Priest. No, no, no. Let him talk. What do you believe in? I okay. just want to know. Just tell me what he's doing. Go back to first John. The only reason why we went back here was because the brother tried to say that truth was not dealing with um, the law when it is. With Christ, it is. Read. And then there's also different. Wait, wait, wait. And here, boy! Wait, back up, back up, brother. There's also different. Like, both of you were right. That's what I was. That, no, no, no. That was the point I was trying to make with him. Why are we striving if we're saying the same thing? Read. And hereby we do know we know him uh -huh. if we keep his commandments. His commandments. Remember, we're in the vein of keeping his commandments. Read on. He that saith, I know him. Come on. And keepeth not his commandments. Read. Is a liar. Come on. And the truth is not in him. Read. But whoso keepeth his word in him, verily is the love of God perfected. Verily is the love of God perfected. So what is his commandments? The Ten Commandments or the two that Jesus left when he left? Give me that. Watch, we go, listen. We'll answer each of your questions. Even though you, you kind of jumped in front of the system. We're going to answer each of your questions. But listen, this reason why I'm answering this question is because it's along the lines of what we're teaching. Give me um, on these two. What you got? Matthew's 5. And that's a basketball game. 2 5 17. Yeah, that's what it is. Alright, got it? Let's go. Matthew chapter 5, verse 17. Hold on, listen up, sis. Brother, listen up. Watch. This is what we believe. Think not that I am come to destroy the law or the prophets. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. Christ said, I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. Read on. Fulfilling. I say unto you, to heaven and earth pass, one jot or one tittle shall in no way pass from the law. Read it again. I want to make sure you heard right. this. I have not Let's come go. to destroy, but to fulfill. So Christ did not come. A lot of people think Christ came and said, listen, everybody, I'm going to die on the cross now, and y'all go do you. You can commit sins, just well, say you believe on me. Right. That's the doctrine that's taught amongst so, our so people. So this is one thing. Hold on, brother. You, listen, if you go ahead and ask me a question. Listen, you got you got to stay to listen. No, I got to answer it in full. But I just want to tell you one thing. I have Jesus Christ inside of me, and you right. fulfilled the law. So while you're under the uh -huh. law still, I'm sorry, but the Let's law is complete. So those who Brother, are under the grace, you say he fulfilled the law. Read that verse Jesus again. In, you're he looking said, at, uh, "Think uh, not that I have come to destroy the law. law. Who don't right. don't right. even right. think that I came for to destroy God's law." Is what he said. Read. Give me Romans six. Hold on one second, brother. Romans chapter 6, verse 1. This is for everybody that thinks, oh, grace, I'm under grace, and that's it. We're done. Read. What shall we say then? 
Shall we continue in sin? Shall we continue to break God's laws that he gave us? Right. Read on. That grace may abound. That we now just live by grace alone. Read. God forbid. God forbid. We are not. Well, listen, listen. What you, what you don't understand about grace is that Christ came and he is now our sacrifice for our sins. That's right. We don't need no lambs. We don't need no goats. That's right. So can you commit adultery now? Of course not. Because wait, 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 wait. I'm going to tell you Answer what. the question. Yes or no? So you didn't hear me when I said Jesus Christ Brother, is inside of me. If he's inside so of you, I then the laws is inside of you, right? I'm prompted by the Holy Brother, Spirit. Brother, are the laws inside of you? The laws are fulfilled inside of me. Are the laws inside of you? The, the laws, laws are fulfilled. How are they fulfilled? You mean you're doing you know, the laws? I'm going to tell you why. Because look at your clothes and you're wearing two different, three different colors. That is the laws. You are breaking the commandment right now. What scripture? Leviticus. I'll find No, brother, you don't know the scriptures. You're not telling Mix. Listen, listen. Right, me, you cannot mix garments. Fabrics. Are you serious? They had colored garments. Silks and you can't listen. You can't mix cotton with silk. <laughs> What's this? So this is all the same? All the same, brother. What are you that talking is the about? same as that? Is that brother, bag on your back brother, the same thing? Hey, there's a shoe. No, 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 listen. Bro, in on. one garment. See, that's what I'm trying to say. Give me Psalm chapter 1 11 verse 10. Watch this. Where are your, your fringes, brother? brother? You keep the law. Bro, I don't Wait, hold on, hold on. Well, I don't brother. keep the law because it's Oh, filled so now the truth is It's fulfilled in me. Read. I am listen, under Romans Romans chapter 3 verse 31. Come on. Do we then make void the law through faith? God forbid. Yea, we establish the law. Whoa. Read that again. Do we listen? Oh, you want to say? Oh, yeah, listen I got it. Romans I'm chapter 3, way. verse 31. <laughs> Do we then make void the law through faith? We're going to make void the laws of God through faith? Meaning what? A man got to have a beard on his face, like your partner is supposed to have if, if you keep the law. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You just said that. Bro, you listen, said you keep the law. I said, I am, don't keep the law. It's fulfilled. It's okay, done. Okay, so guess what? It's done. I said, go back to <laughs> Matthew 5. Because you are in error if you think that you don't got to keep the laws. Why? The difference is in me. No, no, no. What scripture? Give me a scripture. Bro. Everybody stop. Wait. Bible scripture That's right it. now. Wait. Give me the scripture okay, let me go tell to that says the Jesus laws fulfilled the are law, fulfilled right? in you and you don't got to keep let the law. Let me show. Jesus fulfilled the law, right? Uh -huh. Does he still listen to the law? Excuse me? Jesus fulfilled the law. Christ was perfect. Okay. He didn't break the so law. after he fulfilled the law, is, he, is the law still part of him? Brother, what are you talking about? He is the law. He is the word so made flesh. Brother, listen. I'm what you're saying is redundant. No, what I'm How saying is... How are you not? I'm not under the law. I'm Give me revelation. Give me revelation. Chapter 22. Bro. We're going to go to the end of the Bible for you. You're Since saying, you don't I'll understand, we're going to go to the end of the Bible and we're going to get the conclusion. Give me Ecclesiastes The law is fulfilled in me. I'm not under it. Give me revelation 22, verse 14. You guys will understand one day. Right, right. So you don't got to... So you can commit adultery. No, you're not so what's me. the difference when you commit? Wait, what's brother, the, brother, listen. Okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. What's the difference when you commit adultery mm -hmm. and you're not keeping the Lord's Sabbath? What's the difference? Right. There's no difference. Brother, so what are you saying? You keep the Sabbath day holy, no. like you're commanded? No. Yes or no? No, listen. Let listen. your yeas be yeas and your nays be nays. I'm not gonna ask that because I okay, don't brother, have to glorify because you, man. Listen, bro, hey, you don't know. glorify man. Bro, this is what, what I'm saying. What do you mean glorify? That's a straight question. Glorify myself. That means I'm not gonna glorify. Revelations chapter 22. Verse 14. You're not giving me scripture to go to, brother. Remember, the Bible says, as it is written, I'm that to thou mightest be justified yeah. in thy okay. the law So give me the scripture. Not, I'm giving you the scripture. Amen. Right now. The law, your scripture, the law was not, Jesus did not come to demolish the law, but to fulfill it. Let's read on in Matthew chapter 5. Wait, <laughs> we're, we're going to your scripture now. Watch. Read. All right, man, I got to go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Right, right now, now you got to stay for the scripture, Five, though. Five, <laughs> Revelation, um, Matthew chapter 5, verse 17. Come on. Think not that I am come to destroy the law right. or the prophets. Read on. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. He came and kept the laws and fulfilled mm -hmm. the laws. Read on. For verily I say unto you, uh -oh. till heaven and earth pass. Till heaven and earth pass. Yeah. One jot, one jot, yeah. or one tittle, not a comma or a period, yeah. shall in no wise pass from the law. The laws ain't gone nowhere, Galatians brother. We're not done. Read. Till all be fulfilled. Has Christ came back yet? Yes or no? Has all been fulfilled? No. Christ hasn't came back yet. Read. Verse 19. Hold on, just wait a minute. It's gonna make it's gonna be clearer. Read. Whosoever, whosoever. Therefore shall break one of these least commandments. You break one of these least commandments. Like you said, oh, we ain't worried about fringes. You forget that. Jesus Read. Said, and shall teach men so. And what you doing, you out here spreading that madness to everybody else. Read. He shall be called the least 
in the kingdom of heaven. Brother, you're going to be called the least yes, in the kingdom what? of Jesus heaven. Guess what? Jesus was saying that before Amen. he was crucified for us and we received grace. Brother, he was talking to the disciples. Brother, you know brother, the brother, Revelation That was 22. before he died for brother, us. Brother, what you just was, said, watch this. Oh, Let me ask, oh, hold on. Sister, do you Galatians, agree? Wait, Galatians wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute, sister. Do you agree? Scripture. Wait a minute. Do you agree with what this man just said? He's saying this scripture, Matthew chapter 5, does not apply to us right now. That applies to the disciples he brother, talked to before he brother, died and gave us his brother, grace. Brother, Jesus is not watch, a liar. He wasn't talking so to So we're going to go to after he left then. Let's, I'm, I'm, Galatians 2.20. I'm going to cater to you. We're going to get Galatians 2.20. How come y'all didn't go to my brother? Brother, brother, brother. We're going to go right to your scripture. Let, let's read this. Hold on, hold on. Give me Revelation 22, verse 14. This is after Christ was crucified. Sister, hold on one second. Read Revelations chapter 22, verse 14. Come on. Bless and bless are they that do his commandments. Brother, That's right. the Bible says, Blessed are they that do his commandments. What are his commandments? Love, your, love thy neighbor and love God above all. Go and everything else follows under the Lord. Go to Galatians 2 20 so my girl can talk. You didn't get that back. Galatians 2 20. Right, y'all. Go ahead. Let's read Galatians 2 20. Galatians 2 20. Right, right, right. I'm done reading Galatians, Galatians 2 20. Hold on, sister. We gonna get to you. Let's do twenty. That's it. Read. Hold on. It, it, he says this is gonna end it right here, right? It's gonna end it right Let's here. Right. Right. That's, that's what it is. Man. Nobody, it. nobody keeps the commandment because none of them believe it. There goes brother. Every, everybody everybody believes it. A man watch, is watch. 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 He says he's done with Galatians two twenty. Hurry up. Galatians. Galatians. Chapter 2, two verse 20. Come 20. on. He says it's going to end it right here. We don't have to keep God's laws. Is what he's saying. I am crucified with Christ. Come on. Nevertheless, I live. Yet not I, but Christ liveth in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, I live by the faith of the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. I'm dead. I love y'all. Whoa, whoa, brother. Don't run. Hey, where you what going? is the love of God? Let's read it. See how the brother went. Listen, when you don't understand the Bible, you do what? You flee. Mm -hmm. Why? Because the Bible is redundant. You tell me, we just read about seven verses that said, keep God's commandments. And you want to tell me now, oh, one verse that you read that you misconstrued it mm -hmm. to be, don't keep God's laws. That didn't say that in there. Read. Can we I, just read where you can't live by faith. Can I ask you one question? Yes, sir. Didn't Jesus, didn't Jesus say, Hail Israel, the Lord thy God is one God. Right, absolutely. So what does he say? I'm the God, I'm the Son. So what does Jesus say? There's three gods. No, no, no. He didn't say that. He didn't say that. Remember, one God meaning there's the most high. There's one power. There's the most high. Remember, Christ prayed. We're not on that, that whole Trinity right. doctrine. Right. Remember, okay. Okay. Christ was the Son of God. But let's read so something. We all, didn't, didn't Christ say we're all sons of God? Absolutely. absolutely. So how is he the only son? How does how is he the only son? Remember, he's the only begotten son. Did he say son. that? Did who yeah. say that? Christ. Let's go to John 3 16. I said Christ. I didn't say somebody else. What I didn't say the author. I said Christ. Did Christ say he's the only begotten son? Yeah. I don't have a scripture right off the top of my head that I can go to. But you but you but you But listen, hold on, hold on. He never said remember, that. Remember, 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 go to Matthew chapter 17. Watch this. Matthew chapter 17. Right. So what, what this is, is you know what is this, that's Christ speaking in John 3 16, right? If you show me, yeah, I Let's believe go. you. John I believe 3, 16. You. But you have to show me, he said it. Right. I am I am, I am the only begotten son. Right. Remember it says, for God so loved the world. We've been adopted. Christ said that? Christ we've been speaking. adopted. Show me that. We've been grafted in. Get John 3 16. John chapter 3, verse 16. For God so loved the world. That he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. So Christ, so Christ said that? Whosoever, which means anybody. We're going to go no, through that. No, no, no. Watch. I said, did Christ say that? Watch this. This all, what Christ spoke is all no, in no. red. No, no. Show me where Christ said that. Not, no one else. Show me where Christ said Verse that. 10. Jesus answered and said unto him. He began speaking from this point all the way down. This is Christ we'll speaking. Okay. Right here, we'll so, why, verse so why is he, so why is he saying? For God, remember, he's uh, not uh, Jesus is not the most high. That's the doctrine that's no, no, taught no, 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 amongst no, no, no. our people. When he said it's order. It's order. right here. Okay. Or that, I don't know. So that who was believed in him. Why is he talking third person in Remember, Christ spoke, remember he said I open my mouth in parables. 
I don't believe God. I don't believe hey, no man spoke in parables. Brother, that's what the scripture. Do you believe in the I mean, Bible? No, I don't believe. Oh, well, then that's uh, that's the issue, brother. brother. That's good. That's, that's the issue. Issue. One more question. That's the hey, what's up, sister? What's up? Okay. And, and brother, listen. Myself. No, no, listen. I hope you understand. It's not what you got to do is the same thing that we've done. Let me, and I'm not listen. I'm not gonna condemn you right, or nothing. Right. What the scriptures condemn. You. Now, if you okay, listen. Well, so what do you believe? In? What do you what do you believe to be true? I believe in the one God, the same how? God that Jesus prayed to. So how? how? Because what, if Jesus was what, what God, go why, why would He that? pray to Himself? That's the point. He Jesus wasn't is, the most high. Jesus is God. But well, why would he pray to himself? If, he didn't if pray I'm to God, himself. why would I pray to myself? He didn't. He, pray he prayed to his father. That's he what I'm trying to place, show you. which is the temptation. Oh. So he had to pray to his father. Oh, Let's go back to what we well, You got to read the Bible. But brother, I do read it. Brother, watch this. Matthew, watch this. Matthew chapter 19. Watch this, brother. I mean, why would I talk? I mean, that makes, you said parables, but now you're saying third, he focused. So parables are third person. Not just, listen, not just third person. The parables, remember he told the parable of the sower, things like that. He said things in a manner that they were to understand, but some of them weren't going to so, so let me ask you this. So when, um, so you know, do, do, you, know, do, 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 you, do you know what the word Christ means? Christ? Yeah. Messiah. Okay. So, so where is so where's that come from? Where does where that originate from? The Where's word Christ. It it's, 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 it originated from Christos. But what's that? What's that have That's to do Greek. with it? Right, it's Greek. These are Greek words. Right, the, basically. The, the New Testament. The man, was the, so the man wasn't known as Christ. No, we didn't he say that. He was known as Messiah. No, we didn't say so that. So why is Christ in there? Because this is English writing. Watch this. Give me Isaiah. Uh, so, what, so, so let me ask you this. Why? Why? Watch this, brother. Let me, if let the me man spoke the Aramaic, why isn't this in Aramaic and in English? It was translated, brother. No, they no, no, translated no, no. from that to so English. So why don't you have the Give original? Me this. His original, uh, what are the originals saying? How you gonna get it? You gonna go to the Vatican? You understand that they locked all, remember, like I said, I went through the history. I'm telling you, I'm wrong. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you like this. Muhammad, Muhammad, Muhammad has that. what he said. Muhammad has what he said. Watch this, bro. This is why we don't have to worry about the Greek. No, Muhammad has American. what he said. Greek. Isaiah chapter 28, verse 11. Get you, sister, one second, I'm sorry. For with stammering lips. For with stammering lips. And another tongue, another language, will he speak to his people? His people is the children of Israel. This is how we understand the Bible in the so land how do you, of our how do you know what? How, how, how do you know who he's talking to? Yeah, how do we know who he's talking to? Yeah, right. Who are you talking to? Right. Okay. Just remember, because 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 what you're doing, you're jumping from here to here to here to here, but yet you expect somebody to believe that's the word of God. Isaiah chapter 28 verse 10: For precept must be upon precept, precept upon precept. Line upon line, line upon line, here a little and there a little. Amen. That's why we do what we do. What you're going to get, like I said before, precept upon precept. A precept is one part of the Bible that's going to match with another part. So I just have one more Hold question. Hold on one second, it says okay. line upon line, line upon line. So when you go back and read it line upon line, and that you have a clearer understanding of what's going so on. So I just have one more question so for you. Here a little and there a little. So when, Jesus, so when Jesus said, I'll be as Jonah was. For Jonah was, like when Jesus said, I'll be as Jonah was, for as Jonah was three days and three nights uh -huh. in the belly of the well. Right. He said, so shall the Son of Man be three days and three nights in the heart of the earth, right? Right. So can you add that up for me? If if Jesus, brother, 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 he said listen, like listen, Jonah, listen, right? Listen, would you, let me show you what you're doing. You don't believe this book, right? I believe, right? I believe it's corrupted, right? Okay. So, I believe it's corrupted. Just because what you've come to in your mind, you believe that you it's not I'm just, I'm just telling well, you what he's saying. Brother, it was exactly that. He was three days and three nights. So added, can you add Listen, that up for me? Brother, yes, it adds up as three days and Let three me, nights.